everyone. Welcome back to Delta's Creations. Now, this is different. You hardly ever see me on camera, but I thought I would do another short video. I am in the new section, as you can tell. I still haven't put up pictures. It's been a tough week. I've really come down with a nasty, nasty cold. So I think I'm getting better. I'm not sounding a lot better, but it, it's better. I'm in, I'm in my craft haven. I'm doing some projects, so it's good. Now what I wanted to do is I wanted to show you around the other side. You've never seen it other than a few posters that I've ever posted on Facebook. So I thought, well, you'd seen the extension of what we did. So where I'm going to be doing some of my bigger projects, especially my acrylic painting and all that. And some of my resin. But I thought I want to show you around the other side where it actually all started. Because when I moved in with Jim and I was doing jewelry beading and that it was just in a spare room upstairs I, I started doing paperwork and cards so I did it in the conservatory and then we started working from home more and more and then permanently from home and I needed my desk to work from so it became my work desk and then in the evenings I want, if I wanted to do it, something I would clean it all up and um, do some crafting it was getting to me so we eventually built my shed which is the original one and um, that of course was when we the intention when I built it was for all my paper crafting which was what I was doing and my eggs so at the time I thought that's more than enough space one side had the egg counter and the little egg K box where I do the cutting and the other side had a desk and the tables with my cutting machines so it was perfect until I, of course, discovered acrylic pouring and started experimenting with that and all of a sudden the space was not enough. And that's why the extension, which you saw last week. So come, let me take you to the older section of my craft haven. So as I showed you last week, that was the door from the extension, the new part, to the older part. So let's go through. Now, on this side, where all my windows are and there are no opening windows on this side we never did any and that's where my desk is so that's generally where I will do all my paper craft and as you can see that's the wall that divides the two that's the one where we cut into um, <clears throat> and there are my two scan and cuts that I have that's a Gemini under that cover um, I'm going to get a cover done as pretty as the scan and cuts for my Gemini. I'll put a link for the lady that did them for me in the description below. Um, and that's just some, well, I've got some of my paper, obviously that's the door. And over there, as you've seen a few times on some projects, excuse me, that's where I dry sometimes resin because it's actually dust free. But that is also where I cut my eggs. The white piping is where the dust extractor is. And then I've just got a few of my paints there. So that's a, a kitchen counter that I originally put on there. And as you can see, it's quite long. I mean, it's almost the whole length of a, the shed, almost. Tell me a little bit at the end there that I have always had that stand there. And it was it actually used to face the other side um, so I was only making use of three shelves whereas now since we've turned everything around I can actually use it totally and um, so yeah that's that's the older part those are shelves we put up so I could put all my wonderful things and then what I actually did because I was running out of space and needed to put canvases but now most of them have you have moved I used that part, I just put some shelves down and put out some, you know, boxes, some of my paint, my acrylic pores are on there wrapped up so they're dust free, but yeah, so that is my complete craft haven from the old part to the new part. Now as you notice the old part is in this sort of turquoise colour and the new part is white. Because it's so much smaller, I didn't want to paint it dark. I wanted to do it white so it actually looks bigger than it is. 
and that's why we did that white and not the same color as this I didn't want that continuation so there you go you have now seen my entire craft haven it's not a shed it's my craft haven thank you so very much for being here with me for joining me on this journey that has been quite a long one and um, hopefully we'll have a Lots of new projects coming up. I know I have missed one week, so this will make up for that. And um, hopefully my projects will start coming up, backing up, and I will have loads of videos for you to see. Thank you so very much again for being here with me. And remember, wherever in the world you might be, please stay safe, stay well, and I will catch you all very soon. Bye for now.